Allison's vlog, Allison's vlog, Allison's vlog at Alta Vera. She's gonna get her first condo. Alta Vera, she can't wait to live there. I'm here today exploring one of Capitol Hill's cultural icons, the Kirkland Museum of Fine and Decorative Art. And I'm talking with Maya, the membership and marketing coordinator, and we are in Vance Kirkland's actual workroom. So what are the straps for? <laughs> he used the straps to hang above his paintings face down later in his career when he did these dot paintings. And there are different reasons that we think he might have done that. For one, he was short, he was about 5'2", but also he would paint for 10 hours a day sometimes, and you can't paint and lean over across a canvas for that long. And also, you can't see the painting at the same degree that the viewer would see it, you're at a slant. So the paintings are so large, when he was face down in the straps, how did he get to different parts of the canvas? Uh, Vance Kirkland actually used skateboards and he would put the painting on top of the skateboards and that enabled the canvas to move under him to the area he was working on. Well, that's fascinating. Thank you so much for having me and for showing me around the Kirkland Museum and I will really look forward to coming back soon. Thank you.